Hi, it's Vicki with Condi Systems Technical Support, and I'm in Photoshop CS6. And I'm going to demonstrate how to set up your ICC profile color configuration with this application using our profiles here at Condi for both Epson and Ricoh printers. This would work with any of your sublimation or disublimation printers for both Epson and Ricoh. Depending on your model printer, make sure you send an email over to support staff, support at condi.com, request an ICC profile for your model printer so that we can, uh, so that you can get it all set up using that profile and using this video you should have a successful setup. Um, so make sure if you don't know how to get the profiles get with your account manager here at Condi and they can talk you through it. Um, once you have the profile you want to install it by simply saving it to your desktop from your email and then right click on the file, left click on the top uh, in bold install profile. If you have any trouble with that you can call us as well. But once the profile is installed this is the point where you'll be where you'll open your application. This is Photoshop CS6, the latest CS version of Photoshop. And from here you're going to put something on the page. I have a template open. And the reason you need something on the page is because we have to get to our print menu and so without having something up the print menu will be grayed out. So Make sure you have something on the page. Now let's go to our settings. We're going to go to File. We're going to go to Print. That opens the dialog box. And here we're going to choose our printer. We're using the GX7700 for this uh, demonstration, which is the Rico. Again, this would work with any of our sublimation printers. The only thing that's going to be different is the profile. And the profile is based on your model printer. So this profile is going to be a Ditran 7700 profile. Once you choose the printer, come down to color management. Your color handling is done by Photoshop. If you don't see that, drop down and choose Photoshop manages color. Your printer profile is the one that you would have installed and would have been emailed by the support staff here. Your printer profile, find it in your drop down list. We're using the GXE 7700 Ditran, so make sure you choose the one for your model printer. And we're going to come down using our little bar here. We're going to come down. We've got to mirror the image for all Ricoh printers because on Windows operating systems, the, the mirror is always going to be in the app. So under the functions, if you don't see functions open, this little arrow right there, if you left click on it, it'll drop down. You'll see some um, settings in here. You're going to choose the emulsion down, which is to mirror the image or flip it. So make sure that's checked. Once that's done, you're going to come back up here. And we can save the setting under the CS6 um, Photoshop, or with CS6 Photoshop. We have proof set up. You're going to drop down, choose a custom setup. I've already saved mine, but I want to show you how to save yours. You're going to choose device to simulate. It's going to be sRGB. If you don't see that, use your little arrow and uh, get your fly out here opened up so you can come up and choose the sRGB IEC 61966-2.1. That's going to be your, um, your environment is going to be an RGB environment. Our profiles are created with RGB. It's going to give you your best color match. Rendering intent is perceptual and by default your black point compensation is checked. So we're going to click Save. I've already saved mine. Right here you're going to name your setting. You want to type in Condi uh, 7700 if you have a 7700 printer or you could type in 3110. Whatever your model is is what I would type here. I've already typed mine in so I'm just going to select it again and I'm going to click save. It's going to ask me if I want to override it because I've already saved mine and that's fine with me. I'm just going to say OK and then I'm going to click OK here. I'm going to click done. I'm all done with setup with CS6 Photoshop. If you have any questions about how to do this contact us here at Condi. Also look for our documentations online as well as other videos about your driver settings and any additional information you may need. Contact us here at Condi by email or you can call our support staff here by 
by dialing the 1-800 number. Again, this is Vicki with Condi Systems, and as always, thank you for your time.